Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ryan, and today I'm going to be reviewing a beer from the North Coast Brewing Company, and they're based out of Fort Bragg, California. I want to make sure I'm saying that right. Yes, Fort Bragg, California, and this is their Old Rasputin, a Russian Imperial Stout. So, full disclosure, I have indeed had this at least once before. Um, I think it was about, honestly, it was probably about a year ago today, and I had it uh, in a can. So I saw this in the store, uh, knowing I was doing all, all these stouts and dark beers, quads, whatever, and I saw the bottle and thought, yeah, you know what, I'll try it from the bottle this time. Um, so, all right, Old Rasputin, Russian Imperial Stout, and then there's something in Russian, it says product of the United States, brewed in the tradition of the 18th century English brewers who supplied the Russian court of Catherine the Great. Old Rasputin develops a cult following wherever it goes. It's a rich, intense brew with big complex flavors and a warming finish. Let me see if I can find the ABV on this bad boy. This comes in at 9% ABV. Like I said, I have had this before and I do remember very much liking it. However, I cannot remember the exact uh, flavor and you know what notes I got out of it. So let me just check, see, untapped. Says the same exact thing. So. All right, we don't need to waste time on that. Let's bust into it. Try to get ahead here, slightly aggressive pour. Yeah, that's nice. Ooh, let's smell that from here. So that's dark, yeah. That is, that I'm gonna just say that is black. There's a slight tinge of brown at the bottom of the glass here. Poured out, yeah, one finger of, I'm going to say tan colored uh, tight head. Not quite mocha, but it's pushing mocha. See the fast rising bubbles. There we go. <clears throat> All right, let's get a nose on it. So I'm getting like a like a sweet dark fruit aroma. I was like. Uh, Date, I would say. Date or raisin. I'm getting like a roasty malt. I'm getting roasted coffee notes. I'm getting like a chocolate notes. Yeah, this uh, this smells really good. <laughs> really good. Yeah, it's almost like a, a like a bitter baker's chocolate. Again, it's I, I'm gonna say dates. Um, I think before I was saying raisins, but this definitely smells more like I'm getting dates out of this, like chocolate covered dates with a glass of roasted coffee next to me is like what I'm smelling. Uh, let's dive in. Cheers. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's nice. <laughs> I'd say more of a like lower side of medium body. Oh, with like mild carbonation. 
mild to moderate. And so, yeah, it's it's also got this like smooth, creamy mouthfeel to it. it, it it's it's good. So up front, I'm getting that like coffee notes. I'm, I'm getting the, like that that bitter baker's chocolate. Midway through, I'm getting. You know, I guess along with that coffee, it's almost it's also changing like to toffee, going midway through to the palate, and then I'm getting that uh, uh, dark fruit, the 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 date kind of fruit that I'm getting. It's got a a touch of a like a a dry finish to it too, adding like accentuating the bitterness that you get on on the finish it's like that bitter baker's chocolate yeah like comes back on the finish and then there's a slight dryness to it as well nine percent honestly I would not think that this was 9%. I would think this would be more maybe like a seven, seven and a half, eight percent. I mean, so close, but. Yeah, that toffee is really coming out now. I don't know if it's like warming up, but um, I was getting that bitter baker's chocolate up front along, you know, now and, and, and like coffee uh, notes. Now I feel like the coffee's kind of turning into toffee, um, mixing well with the, the, the dark fruit, the, the, the date. I will say, I think I was getting more flavor and more notes when I had it out of the can than I am out of the bottle. All right, so um, I think, I, you know, I hate to say this, but I think I'm going to give this a slightly lower score than I did last time. I really like it still. It's really good. I think I may prefer it out of a uh, can than I do the bottle. So. North Coast Brewing Company, their Old Rasputin Russian Imperial Stout from a bottle. Um, I'm going to give this a 4.5 out of 5. It's still a great beer. Like I, I, I'm really enjoying this. Again, perfect on you know in the winter time when it's cold. Here I am. I've been you know wearing this hoodie now on many of my reviews. It's my my bum around the house hoodie. <laughs> Uh, anyway, <laughs> I'm rambling on here. I feel like I, I need to wrap this up, wrap this up here. All right, uh, that's all for this video. Hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and comment down below. Let me know, have you had Old Rasputin? And what did you think of it? And also let me know, have you had it out of the can and the bottle? And which did you prefer? Until next time, peace.